What's up guys, uh, today we finally get a jailbreak for the iPhone 4 and a bunch of other i devices. So I'm going to show you this is an iPhone 4 and uh, we're not going to use a computer this time because the jailbreak is within Safari. So go to Safari and type in jailbreakme.com. So we're going to type that right now. Alright, sorry for the uh, bad camera, but it's the best I can do right now since VNC Viewer is not downloaded yet. But for now, we have jailbreakme.com and see it has a message saying that you can do tweaks, apps that Apple won't allow. So, slide to jailbreak. And it's going to take a, a while. It took me about four minutes, three to four minutes. So, I'm going to put that down for now. Alright, so I just. Uh, crop that out so right now we're in the last uh, screen here it's telling you to it's jailbreaking right now and sit tight so just to warn you guys about this that not every single city app will work on the iPhone 4 this just came out and not many developers out there have yet tested out the new iPhone 4 so don't be surprised if SBS you know SB settings doesn't work or winterboard so I'm gonna make a video about that later on so just sit tight and subscribe for now and what else can I tell you uh, yeah uh, this is not need a program you don't have to be on Windows or Mac you just need your iPhone 4 or just an iDevice and just go into Safari and type in jailbreakme.com so the, the message is gone and says city has been added to the home screen so we're gonna go back to the home screen and as you can see we finally have Cydia so we're gonna tap on that now, I don't know if the load times are better in this, but coming from an uh, iPhone 3G, it does seem a lot faster. Well, the first thing that pops up in City is telling you who are you. So, logically, more common users will pick the user. So, right now, it's loading City right now. Um, yeah, it's actually going a lot faster compared to my iPhone 3G. And uh, don't be surprised if there's a few bugs in City. I'm sure there will be a uh, update about it. And uh, the first uh, message they give you is your ACID number. So that's just a handy little message right there. And at the bottom, you have your option of I hate jailbreaking, so make it go away. So you pretty much, if you don't like it, you can restore it back to what it was on iTunes. But other than that, Cydia looks the same. You just got to install the upgrades. And everything else is pretty much there, guys. Uh, that's all I can tell you right now. Uh, don't waste time. Just do it for now and uh, I'll post new videos up detailing about the city apps so please subscribe rate comment whatever you want and I'll see you guys later peace